Give him some space. When this baby thresher shark thrashed its way into shore near the Balboa Pier in the middle of one of the busiest beach days of summer, it kept coming back up to the shoreline so and getting stuck on the beach. Terry Bradford shot this cell phone video. I felt bad for it because it just could not get back out into the water. Hundreds gathered and watched as nearly a dozen Newport Beach lifeguards tried to keep the shark and beachgoers safe. The lifeguards were trying to tell everybody to get back. The lifeguards um, like went on their megaphones and ordered everybody out of the water. So that was kind of scary at first because we're like, oh my gosh, are there more sharks? Witnesses say the shark appeared injured. When I washed up on shore, there was like a fin missing or its fin was cut. I think it was actually injured in the tail. It had like a big cut or whatever. So it wasn't bleeding or anything. It just had this big slash on the back of it. Lifeguards tried to rescue it and managed to carry the shark to a waiting truck. Animal control officers say it had to be euthanized. It needed to be done. I mean, it wasn't going to be able to survive out there like that. The state's senior fish pathologist told me in the last four days, five thresher sharks from Newport Beach to Santa Cruz have stranded themselves. More and more sharks are dying from a brain infection. Marine biologist Dr. Chris Lowe says this shark may have been injured after it was infected. And what we found is that they actually get uh, an infection of a bacterium in their brain. That bacterium actually starts to eat away the brain and it kind of turns the sharks into like zombies. They become disoriented um, and they basically swim themselves into shore where they strand. A lot of times the public finds them thrashing around and try to push them back out. But those sharks, unfortunately, are going to die. Of course, we won't know what caused that shark to come ashore until a necropsy is performed. The state fish pathologist expects that to happen no later than Monday. In Newport Beach, Stacey Butler, KCAL 9 News.